What's going on everybody? My name is Chris the Chaos Gamer and welcome back to Pokemon Snakewood. In the last episode, we um we figured out a little bit of backstory to Alicia and how apparently I used to be a death caller. And um in terms of the story, we're on our way now to Meteor Falls, which is south of Farlabor. And to uh, um basically go straight to the base of operations on the four horsemen in Gleese. and we're gonna wreck some stuff up so if you guys are excited for today's episode be sure to click that thumbs up button like you never clicked it before and subscribe to the channel if you want to keep watching the series because uh, your support is greatly appreciated so uh, we're gonna start off by going over the team real real quick we got Polk the ball toy level 35 347 experience left to evolve so close but yet so far away uh, he's rocking Psybeam, Harden, Rapid Spin, and Ancient Power next is Maya or Gyarados holding the Gamble Fish with Twister, Tackle, Bite, and Surf next is Dega, Mystery Egg holding the Brain Link with Harden, Leech Life, Softball, and Egg Bomb we have Gary or Slugma level 35 with Yon, Ember, Rockthrow, and Harden holding the Demon Horn. Sapuku or Nuzleaf level 36 with Bide, Faint Attack, Cut, and Fake Out holding the Leftovers. And the newest addition to our team, I thought about it after. And I was thinking about it, it was like, we're heading into Pokemon that's all relatively close to level 40. So I decided that we were going to put our shiny... Terry the Aerodactyl level 40 on the team. He's not holding anything right now, but he has Bite, Supersonic, Ancient Power, and Scary Face. Just so that, you know, we have someone on the team who can, and he's fast. I think he's even fat. I think he's even faster than Maya. Yeah, Maya's speed one si is 64, <laughs> and Terry's is 121. Like, that is just crazy. So... Um, there's a, there's a bit of water here, so before doing anything with that, actually, three two or three episodes ago, I had a comment about uh, the, asking what was it? I the question of the day was for that episode was if I were to have any team. Oh, Rocks. Oh, I need rock. I need to get rock smash right real quick. All right. So on the way back, I'm gonna I'm gonna say this. So we just saw. So so we were just surfing there. And um, I was thinking about it, and I just thought about. I was thinking about it in between episodes. That the last time that we surfed, in which. Because this this is going back to the quillfish. Because the quill because the last time we saw quillfish was all the way back to Slateport. Or at least the area right underneath Slateport. And that was a that was a watermon. Accessed only through surf, and I just thought about it then. Was that there's water here. More than likely that would mean that maybe there's some quillfish here. Raisin? A raisin? What's that? A manly sweet raises attack. Ooh. Let's give that to Sapuku, actually. Alright. So, yeah. So, I was thinking. I'm gonna use the... No, let's run. Um, so, I was thinking was that... We get ourselves a quillfish. We'll see what level it is. We may or may not replace Maya. I don't know. Um, because I definitely want to keep Slugma. Because we needed a fire type. And right now he's like for any for any mon that was uh, that threatened the team. Slugma really pulled through. Um, I don't know. I'm just thinking, like, if we were to find a quillfish here, 
Let's just see if we can find a quillfish first. We might not even find one. There might not be any... Oh, never mind. Is this a quillfish? Level 27. Level 27 quillfish. Um, let's go ancient power. The question I want to know now is... You know what? I'm going to psychic or Psybeam. I shouldn't be. I shouldn't take it out from this range. Um, so I'm just thinking. Poison type would not be that bad. And I just killed it. Wicked. I mean, Dega grew to level 28. Uh, <laughs> there's also a surfable wall up here. Okay, so if we find another quillfish, which we don't. I don't want to stay around here for too long, but the fact that these guys are level 27s, these are definitely higher than the quillfish over by Slateport. At least then I don't have to go very far. And here we go, level 13. I am not sticking around for a level 13 quillfish. Not happening. Um, because one of the, because the guy on, because, um, the comment, ooh, level 29, much better, because the comment said that he wanted me to use a quillfish. I can see why, because it's a poison type and we don't have any poison types on the team. However, um, you know, well, it's in Dega. Um, the fact that it's water poison. Okay, first of all, you have Pin Missile. Um, see what Egg Bomb does. I don't know. I don't know if I want to use him because we just pretty much got a full team of six now. That works. You have Headbutt, Pin Missile, and of course we flinch. Fun times. Um, it's not a good idea if I send out Gary, but you know what? We're going to. <laughs> of course, you have Water Gun. Alright. Um, let's do Rock Throw. Get minimize. Minimize Pin Missile. Body Slam? I think I saw body slam and minimize. Let's put you to sleep. Oh, headbot, sorry, not not heavy slam. Flame body. <laughs> All right. I really want to put you to sleep. I really. Oh wait, no, I can't put you to sleep now because you're burned. That's fine. I forgot. All right, let's try catching you. Let's try using the Great Ball. If not, we'll try a Dive Ball. So we got one, two, three. Got him. All right, what shall we name this Quillfish? The small spikes covering its body developed from scales. They inject a toxin that causes fainting. If stung by this Pokemon, immediately consult a doctor. Yeah. <laughs> Alright. Quillfish. This is a... Mm, female? Yeah, female Quillfish. Um, let's call you... I'm trying to think what to name you. I can call you Puffy. Let's call you Puffy. <laughs> Alright, so we, ju we just caught Puffy the Quillfish. Okay. So, if I were to get rid of anybody on the team, who would it be? 
for Quillfish. Because apparently he really wants me to use a Quillfish. You have God's Tear. What is God's Tear? Brave Nature. With Minimize, Headbutt, Water Gun, and Pin Missile. I mean, you don't have any poison type moves, but I could easily give you the toxic that I had in last episode. I'm curious now. Uh, Quillfish. Let me just see something here. Quillfish. Oh. Has the ability switched to more poison point? I didn't see what its ability was. Poison point, which is nice. It evolves. It evolves. Level 33. Oh. Okay, I'm not checking to see what mon that is, but apparently it evolves to level 33. So I'm curious what that God's tier is too. All right. I want to keep the Aerodactyl. I want to keep Mega. mega has been doing excellent work. Slugma, yes, I want to keep Slugma on the team. Poic, absolutely. Dega, I looked up Dega one time before. I see what I know what it evolves into. Oh, whoops, I forgot its item. I know what it evolves to, but. The problem I have with it, oh, the problem I have with date with mystery egg, whoops, is that it has to go through two more evolutions. I don't know what God's tier is. I need to get the brain link back. Uh, just very quickly, let's put Quillfish back in here. Don't worry, you're coming right back in. And then we go Pokemon, Dega, Item, Take. Alright. Where are we to? 12 minutes. Uh, we're gonna move Pokemon, Quillfish, and replace it with Dega. Alright. Yeah, so... I lost my train of thought there because um, because mystery egg evolves into like I think it's like two other egg mons and extremely high level too like if I remember correctly the next evolution it had was like 30s and then the next one was like 50s I think someone in the comments will uh, double check that for me I'm sure um, but the evolution that you get after the third egg evolution, yes, is broken. I kind of don't want to go that route because it's because they're legendaries. <laughs> I kind of don't want to go that route. Um, so I'm going to keep Puffy in the team for now. See what happens. And yeah. All right. Let's see what this god's tier was. Raises the power of water type moves. All right. First of all, okay. First, let's give the brain link to Puffy because you are now the. All right. Uh, I also could put that bro uh, that broken heart I found in the last episode in the box. Uh, mail storage. Uh, deposit. Broken Heart. Um, God's Tear. I think I will use God's Tear. Or I'll keep it in the box. I'll keep it in the... I'll keep it in the items for now until... Um, until Quillfish evolves. Level 33 is actually not that far. Alright. So, let's see what's down here. We can go back here... Looks like we got a nice few battles. Are you a trainer? I'm on guard. What are you? Oh! You! Chris! Good to see you! 
Let me get this straight. Let me get straight to the point. I have a favor to ask of you. Yeah? The four horsemen I, kn I know, I know, are using Meteor Falls as their hideout. We are going to storm it. I mean, we kind of thought this over with Alicia already. That's right. You and Alicia are going to go in first, since you're way stronger than any of us. Find your way straight to the horsemen and take them down. The full power of the Inquisition will be behind you to protect you two from the zombies they'll summon. Just get to the horsemen. If I can spare anyone, I'll, sir, I'll send you back up. That won't be necessary because apparently me and Alicia got this. I believe you, Chris. And, oh, sorry. I believe you. And Chris? Yeah? Don't listen to the Deadly Seven. They'll only drive you insane. I mean... I mean, they all speak... in riddles... Like, okay. Apparently I can't go upstairs. I can see why they're on guard now. Alright, we need... I want to say that these guys are trainers, and if that's the case, Poic is staying in, and there's C-Dots here. As you can see, I already have one. Or had or had one. <laughs> Alright, so before moving any further, we got Poic and Maya. Uh, Poic and Maya, yeah, sure. <laughs> we'll get... We don't care you're on our side. We want revenge. Sure. Let's do it. Inquisition, double act. Sends out Golem and Agron. Ooh, good thing we have Maya. I'm just hoping that um, Poet gets an evolution this episode. Alright, I'm going to hit Harden and then you're going to hit Surf. Because this is going to hurt. Golem, almost dead. And Agron, I mean, that was actually pretty good damage for Surf, actually. I'm not going to lie. Considering everyone is relatively the same level, 35, 36, and everyone's 36. So, that was an... Ooh. I don't know what to do here. I'm going to do some damage on Agron. Yo, he's super potion. I mean, not like it matters. You're about to die. That golem is definitely going to go down. Bye-bye, golem. Bye-bye. See you later. Come on, Necron. <laughs> 36. You know what this means. If this kills the Agron... <laughs> I would have laughed so... Yep, substitute. That's funny. All right, we're not even gonna bother using another surf. Oh, you have super potion. That's fine. Bite. That did nothing. And side beam. That did. All right. Next is we're gonna surf. All right. I am pretty sure Poic is going to evolve right now. In that's the case, we got two new mons. Oh, two new, two new mons. You know what that means. <laughs> $28,000 and... Woo! Poic is now evolving into a clay doll. Love it. <laughs> Leo change! <laughs> two Leo changes this episode. Oh, fun times. Oh, uh, Poic is now clayed all. I was waiting. Hyper Beam. I mean... I'm... Rapid Spin has been doing shit and no one is using spikes. So, I'm gonna get rid of Rapid Spin for Hyper Beam. On the, and on the turn that he's gonna recharge, I can just swap out. So... All right, let's pick up these person berries. I don't know why I just skipped that middle one there. All right. So we actually did, well, we didn't do a lot. I want to do a lot more in the next episode because we're 
pretty much at 20 minutes, or we are at 20 minutes right now. So, I'm gonna end things off here, so, what did we do? We caught a quillfish, got rid of Mystery Egg for the for, uh, Puff the Quillfish, and Poic evolved into a clay doll. Woo! Been waiting for this. I've been waiting for that. All, like, pretty much ever since we had the, uh, ever, ever since we had the ball toy. I was like, please. So, <laughs> and it's our starter too, so it's even better. <laughs> So, in the next episode, hopefully we're going to get ourselves to Meteor Falls. And, uh, yeah. So, if you guys enjoyed the video, be sure to click that thumbs up button like you never clicked it before. And subscribe to the channel for more videos like this one. I've been Chris the Chaos Gamer, and I will see you in the next video.